Here's a song that I've grown into. Well, yeah. My love is alien. I beat the rub by chance. There's these strange chords. She's a minor key. to the I think it's Australian Music Hall of Fame and it was you know them being older and this is a song they chose to do for that sit in that uh, show how cool yeah it was kind of neat to see it's kind of neat to see them do and there was all these uh in fact yeah it was all of them all six of them even these Mal guys, even Mal guys. was back playing drums yeah on it nice and everything I, this song reminds me of I don't know if you remember on the next album Wayata, um Ghost Girl. It kind of reminds me of Ghost Girl from that album. It's kind of the Maybe it's we'll kind of the strange we'll ballad. Listen to that album. Sometimes. What really? <laughs> we gotta we gotta listen to. That. I love that idea, Del. You're brilliant. <laughs> no, go ahead, Keith. I interrupt you. I'm sorry. That was uh, that was a single too. I don't know which single was, but it was a single, one of the singles from this album. So, um, from, oh, this song. You're talking about. But well, you were this, talking about why? Poor boy. Poor. Well, yeah. Now I'm talking about poor boy. Uh, oh, okay. The one we just listened to. Yeah. So it just reminds me of Ghost Girl from the next album. Okay. So. I'll have to check that out. All right. <laughs> Changing direction. Cool.
Like, what's the matter with you? I thought was very Beatles. -ish. Right. Yeah. Like early Beatles. I love this. Love it. they used to do in their hotel rooms they didn't trash them they didn't get drunk they didn't do drugs they made paper airplanes really yeah you mean you mean a paper airplanes was a thing that they would do they would do I mean, they like, would they would if they ran out of paper like, they would use magazines or the phone book and just make paper and just shoot them on down the hallway no, into the lobby. Try to make them do tricks. Yeah. Try to make them fly far. That was their thing. That was, <laughs> that their, was their thing. <laughs> their deal. They were like, well, imagine, uh, imagine if you were like someplace going, you see paper airplanes. Oh, split ends must be here. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, their groupies probably collected them, right? Yeah, that was in yeah, one of their uh, find them. Spellbound. That was a documentary. <laughs> they have a couple of documentaries on them. Do they? Yeah. It's it's kind of interesting. That's why I was talking about them being survivors. This was like, a, you know, they had many different mix-ups, and you know, people band would, personnel like important people would leave, you know, and and yeah, they, they, but they Person, personnel, yeah, yeah, you know, part and and then they would have no luck. Like they just frenzy did terrible. I mean, Dysteria didn't do that great, and frenzy did worse. Even though I see red was. Made it pretty big, a hit. Uh, made it a yeah. hit and everything. But they 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 were in UK trying it out, and they gave up and came back came back well, not gave up. They came back to Australia. In fact, they had a they had they had lost chrysalis. They weren't worth chrysalis anymore. Um, right, and they were this mushroom or yeah, something. Yeah, and but uh, they got they actually Polydor. got a grant from Amen. from Australia. It's the Australian Music. Some sort of government like art fund or something. Arts, no, the New Zealand Arts Council. That's what it was. Yeah, New Zealand, right? Gave them a five thousand dollar grant, and it kind of helped save them and pay some bills and and bridge right? the when thing. They, and that's and, right. Apparently, go ahead. Yeah, apparently when they when they when they went into the studio, they were you know deeply in debt. Right. Um, and they were wondering how they were going to pay for this album. Right. And. And luckily, yeah, luckily this album became a smash hit worldwide. So. 